Hi, today we are going to look at creating new variables based on the calculation of the other existing variables. For example, if let's say preference choice 1 and preference choice 2 can be used for one independent variable and preference choice 3, 4, 5 are actually questionnaire questions that is used for another independent variable. So in this case, we will need to have another new variable which will calculate mean of preference choice 1 and 2. In other words, we want to combine preference choice 1 and 2 into one new variable by taking del mean. So how can we do that? Go to transform, compute, and this target variable is actually your new variable name. For example, this is for preference choice 1 and 2. And we can actually get the formula from here, or you can actually write your own formula. Let's say I want to use mean, so click up. And this is to include preference choice 1, click, and comma, and also preference choice 2, click here to insert it and that's all let's execute it okay and we can see the output this has been executed the formula all right so this is a new variable that we have produced based on preference choice one and preference choice two because these two questionnaires are actually used to collect data regarding one independent variable you can do that for dependent variable as well if you have more than one questionnaire question to calculate or to measure on one dependent variable so let's look at the data view this is how it looks like your preference choice two which is based on your preference choice one and two it is actually to add some sum up one plus zero divided by two you got 0 0.5 one plus one equals to two divided by two you got one that's how easy you can do this and you can also use the same way to calculate the mean for preference choice three four five if if they belong to the same one independent variable